Well, I guess that's what you said. Who wants to do it? So I'll let you do it. it. It's a long one. <laughs> Other cities have used their arts communities to spearhead growth and even rebirth in former industrial areas. For example, Brooklyn, New York's recent resurgence began with rental incentives and property tax waivers being granted to all professional artists. Musicians and artists of all types were attracted to Brooklyn and created a new hip place to be, drawing high income professionals in their wake. Do you see Cornwall's thriving arts community figuring in to the city's post mill rebirth? And if so, how would you encourage them? Wow, thank you. Well, I'd like to welcome all of you tonight. And I understand that you want to know what we're going to be doing with the fine community of Cornwall. Knowing that you're all here for a reason, you are all very important, and the arts is very important. You have to look at the music that we have. You have the culture, different music. You have different cultures to uh, look at what we can offer you, whether it's a book, and, and I understand that I was at the literacy school not too long ago, and uh, I found it very educational. I found that they came out and voiced their opinion and let me know what they were doing at the school, being that they took that large step just to get that education. And for that, I applaud every single student that's going to the literacy school because they deserve a medal for trying. And I know that when they do graduate, I want to be the first one there to give them that certificate. Oh, because they're special. Now the next thing is we're going to have to look at the music. We have musicians here, and we have a lot of them, but we have a little problem. They would like to perform, but we can't allow them to perform for whatever reason. I understand that we have some agents that would like to bring in their bands and a lot of their music in, but we're having a little communication. But we're hoping to straighten that out very quickly. Uh, as far as the type that we will attract here, we have a multi-culture. Being that you are multi-culture, and uh, Marie here has her nation parade that she does every year, which is very nice, and she does put in a lot of work, and there's costumes, there's, and this, this year they had their own music as well, which again, she should be applauded for the work she put into the nation parade. Congratulations to Marie. It's not that you're not being paid attention to, it's just that you come by great numbers and you should be all looked at. And as far as the art, you're a painter, then expose it and I'm sure people will look at it. Because as you're painting, you're telling a story and that story is very important. As far as the agents that are wanting to produce their music and their musicians and their bands in Cornwall, we should open up our arms and say, come on in, you know, what can we do and how can we work with you? Because you're important. Bring in the business and let's negotiate, because that's where we're at, you know. And if we all work together, we can grow this city, we can publicize it, and you know, we can go on a website and we can make it more viable for the outside tourists to come in and see what we have to offer them. I thank you very much for listening to me. You have yourself a nice day. Take care.